All right, guys, we're gonna make a quick video. So yeah, we're gonna test out the carrier today. I wanna see how much the van sags because I am thinking about either going with um, airbags or helper springs to help with added weight before I decide to purchase either one of those. I wanna see how much the van sags because it does have brand new shocks all the way around. Um, also has two inch blocks in the back. So I'm just curious how much it'll sag. So we got the moto tote. This thing is rated up to 600 pounds. Uh, we got it bolted in. And we're gonna be throwing on the 2013 BMW F800 GS. This thing weighs around 470, give or take wet. So with the bags and everything, I'm gonna guess anywhere from five to 550. So without further ado, we are gonna push this thing up the ramp and see if uh, we don't break anything. So stay tuned. We should be all right. Now the question is, how do you get the, uh, the ramp out, though? The bike's on. I can't get the ramp off. So that's an issue. And, like, I've tried lifting it all the way up. It's just not wanting to come out if i can't get to ramp off how am i supposed to get it on you know what i mean so i went to moto totes website this is the max plus carry which is what i have it says wheelbase up to i don't know if it's going to focus but it says 62 inches okay my bike this is a 2013 bmw f800 gs all right the wheelbase for this bike, right there. I don't know if you can see it. I don't know why it's not focusing. It says 62.1 inches. But that is something to think of, guys. The wheelbase is, you know, pretty important. I just assumed I could fit this bike on here and take the ramp off. I Literally, I didn't think of this problem at all. This did not even pop in my head. But, and I tried pulling it up you know, but these tabs are so far in there, it's it's really hard. I'm not gonna be taking this bike with me anyways, but I did wanna drive it around the block just now with this with it on it. I wanted to see how it handled the van. But, um, so yeah, other than that, I'm happy with it. It's, it's been up here for like 20 minutes. It's been holding very well. Um, I'm using some Pro Shape, bleh, Pro Taper. They're considered hookless, even though it has a hook. Um, and I like how the carabiner just goes around here, so that's really nice, simple. But yeah, pretty wicked. It's not sagging the van a whole lot, honestly. A little bit. I'm gonna measure it right now, and then measure it again with the bike off. This side over here, we're at like 36 and a quarter. I'm gonna remeasure it once I roll the bike off. All right, bike is off. And yeah, this is almost 37 again, like 36 and three quarters. So yeah, 